guys! This is um, Jennifer of Little Shelf, and this is my first In My Mailbox vlog. In My Mailbox is a meme hosted by Christy over at the Story Siren. So if you want more information, um, if you're on my blog, you can click the link above. And if you're on YouTube, you can click the link below, and the link to my blog will be below the video also. So I had an amazing week in books, so that's why I wanted to um, do a vlog to share with you guys what I got. So the first book that I got this week is Blood Rites by Kristen Painter. So a few weeks ago on um, the Waiting on Wednesday meme, I posted that I could not wait for Blood Rites to come out. Um, and the cover is just gorgeous, so I posted a giant picture of it. And Kristen actually saw that I posted her picture, and she sent me an email asking if I wanted an advanced reader's copy. And my answer was, um, of course, yes, oh my gosh, <laughs> so excited. So thank you, thank you, Kristen. Um, she also you see that, signed it and personalized it to me, which I wasn't expecting. Super awesome. Thank you, Kristen. I'm so excited. Um, so this book comes out in October of this year, 2011. Um, so I won't be posting a review of it until probably July or August or September, closer to the release date. Um, but I couldn't wait to read it because it was sitting there calling my name. And it's awesome. I'm probably, I'm about that far into it. So I have like only a quarter of the book left. And it's great. It's fantastic. The world she builds in here, everything, it's great. Um, but I will put a more in-depth review up in a few months. So the great thing about this book is that it comes out in October, and then I believe the next two books following this book, in the, um, I think it's going to be a trilogy, come out in November and December, if I'm right. So it come out October, November, and December. And that is super awesome because this book is great, and I can't wait until November to get the next book in the series. So the next book that I got this week, which I'm also really excited about, The Twilight Saga Official Illustrated Guide. I got it off of Amazon. I don't know about all you other Twilight fans out there, but I've been waiting a really long time for this. And it's definitely made me crave reading Twilight all over again. So the first 60 to 80 pages of this um, are an interview between Stephanie Meyer and another author that she chose. And, um, you know, she just talks about where she got Twilight, the idea for Twilight, how she wrote it, and in what order, and um, yeah, really interesting stuff in there that I didn't even know. And I've watched quite a few interviews and read quite a few interviews with Stephanie. So really great. And then the next part of the book talks all about the vampires. And it even has... And then it even has um, pictures drawn by the same, the same um, person who illustrated the uh, graphic novel. So, um, Young Kim. Awesome. So she did some of the pictures in here also. Super cool. And then she also goes into stuff like the backgrounds, um, like Alice and all, all the vampires. She goes into their backgrounds, but Alice's was cool because in the books, we don't know what Alice's past is because Alice is forgotten. And so Stephanie tells us all about their past. Um, some stuff I knew and some stuff I didn't know. She also talks about, um, you know, the wolf pack and all of them and all the main regular characters. And, and then at the end, it also has different covers from different uh, different countries all over the world of Twilight. So yeah, if you like Twilight or if you love Twilight, it's definitely, definitely worth it. It's awesome. Um, it's really thick. It's like 500 pages. Yeah, super great. I've gotten about that far. but So the next book that I got this week is uh, Nightshade by Andrew Kramer. Isn't it pretty? Super excited to get this book. I've waited a long time for it. I've heard nothing but really great things about it. The only thing is that I'm kind of disappointed because I got it from Amazon and I didn't get a perfect copy of it. Um, you can kind of see here, like, the picture is kind of rubbed off and it was kind of bumped to the top here. And it looks like it's kind of curved a little bit. 
my cat's over there watching me. But I love the frayed, like, torn page look. Super awesome. Very pretty. And the next book that I got off of Amazon this week, The Morganville Vampires, Volume 2. So it's book uh, two and three and four, book three and four out of the series Midnight Alley and Feast of Gold. And I love the bind up, the bind up version of this much better than the original covers. So, yay, for only four dollars. And the last book that I got this week, I won on Goodreads, Never Knowing by Chevy Stevens. So I think like five under five hundred other people won this. So that's a lot of books to send out. Um, thank you, St. Martin's Press. So it's about a girl who goes looking for her biological parents, um, and it turns out that, you know, where she comes from is not so great, it says, only to discover the terror and horror in which she was conceived. I don't know if you can hear my kid screaming in the background there. But, um, yeah, the little um, press release that St. Martin's Press sent with this said that they've been talking nonstop about it, and it sounds really dark and really great. So thank you, St. Martin's Press. So, um, yeah, epic week for me. Fantastic books. I'm really, really, really excited for all of them. Can't come up with a better word than that. Um, yeah, so um, great week in books for me. Super fantastic. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so that was my first vlog. Uh, thanks for watching if you made it all the way through. Yeah, go ahead and leave me a comment at the bottom and let me know what you got in your mailbox and I'll go visit your blog. My kitty. She was watching. Here's a bam. Here's a bam. Here's a bam.